Welcome to Cheap Joe's Art Stuff. My name is Julie and I'm here to impart some knowledge to you today via a two minute art tip. And today we're gonna be talking about something um, a little bit, you know, maybe outside of your comfort zone, but um, moving outside your comfort zone is good. And uh, I'm here to tell you that looking at the human figure and incorporating that into your work can be a very, very important milestone for your work. So, you know, you're going, what? I don't, I don't care about that. But let me tell you maybe why you should. For centuries, um, drawing and um, interpreting the human form has been an important part of artistic journeys. Um, and the reason is, is that you got a body, I got a body, everybody's got one. And so you understand intuitively when you're looking at an image of a body, like when you get it right and when you get it wrong, right? Because you understand there's a commonality of feel about like what it feels like to be inside of a human body. Um, so you know, um, oh wait, that person's arm's too long or what's the matter with that person's thigh and stuff. So there is a very, very important um, structure uh, to learning how to interpret the form that translates into everything. But there's another whole element to um, using the human form in your work. Cause like maybe you're sitting here going, Julie, I, I don't care about this. I do landscapes. Well, there's nothing more relatable than seeing a human in a landscape. It, it creates mood. It creates feel. It also demonstrates scale very easily. Um, and so there's something about the human experience that gets conveyed when you see, you know, a human being inside of an environment or, you know, um, in association with other, you know, forms and stuff like that. So take a look at um, using the human form. I know I ain't a I'm not afraid of it. I don't have any problem with it at all. I do it all the time. But um, it is a very, very um, integral part to conveying mood, theme, feeling, you know, um, you know, all kinds of different emotions and, and things that can't be duplicated other ways. So if you haven't already, take a look at um, incorporating more of the human form into your work. It, it does amazing things and we're sure you're gonna enjoy.